uh, hello friends today in this tutorial i will be talking about uh, a dependency of node.js which is used to generate random passwords which are unique and which are strong this is the official documentation of this module node.js module go to npmjs.com and search for this module which is generate dash password it has got you will see 194,000 weekly downloads and uh, it's a very stable module you can use inside your production application so i will be taking a very simple example of this module so now to get started inside your node.js project so i will go to my projects directory and uh, i will open command line here and simply i will make a new directory which is uh, random pass so i will go to into this random pass folder and what I will do is that I will make a new project npm init dash y so this will create the package.json file and now we can open that inside visual studio code text writer so you will see this is the package.json file which contains the basic information about your project name version description now we need to install this module which is pretty simple which is npmi generate dash password so install this it will hardly take five seconds so it has successfully downloaded inside the dependency section here now we need to uh, make index.js file we will include the module which is generate password we will require this module which is generate password that's it now to call this it is very simple in the documentation you will see there are one method which is there it takes two arguments length of the password and if you want to include numbers you can put this true or false and simply it will console log the random password so now we can do this uh, we can say here so what is that so the password so we can declare a variable here password and here we can use generate password dot generate and inside this this takes the object here first parameter is length of the password we need 10 character password then we don't need to include numbers so we can put false here if you want to include numbers you can put numbers to true then we can console log our password on the console here command prompt we can now run the application just put node index.js so now this is a 10 digit password here you will see it doesn't include number you can also put this to true here so it will now include the numbers as well if you once again run this now it will be including numbers here you can make this any digit of your choice let's suppose 50 digit password random password and this is the 50 digit password here you will see 50 digit password you can make a very awesome online tool which can drive millions of visitors to your website so the possibilities are endless this is a great node.js library which is used here and uh, it also contains one other method this is only applicable for if you want to generate single password so in many scenario users are looking to generate multiple passwords for that scenario we have uh, another here multiple password so here once again this generate password module contain two methods here which is generate multiple so the same options will be applicable here we can put the length of each password let's suppose 10 characters and numbers we can allow false that's it in this case so you can just see you can also put uppercase bulk generate multiple passwords at once with the same options for all returns an array so basically now it will return a array here of multiple passwords here you can put the length how many characters uppercase will be false here so also there is an option of uppercase this also need to be false so we can now say here multiple 
passwords we can console log it for multiple and this will be applicable for single password so now we can run the application to just check python sorry node index.js so this is the single password and this is i think is uh, sorry what is happening here so i think Mm, why it is not just wait I am just seeing it oh sorry we need to provide how many passwords we need to generate in the first argument so that is why we need to generate let's suppose 10 passwords 10 and then we can put a comma here that's it so that was the thing that we were missing so you just need to provide the numeric value how many passwords you need to generate so if you generate this you will see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So now you can save all these pass passwords in a text file. You can just put it, uh, loop through each password and you can save it inside a text file, CSV file, Excel file, whatever file format that you will allow your users to save these passwords. And you can just prepare a very awesome little online tool and people can use that to to generate random passwords so the possibilities are endless this is a great online uh, module which is brought to you by node.js which is used to generate random uh, passwords for users with the help of this module you can all also generate single password or bulk password also so which is all uh, coming in node.js and javascript so thanks very much guys for watching this video i will be seeing you in the next video